it is customary for former presidents, when they are no longer president of the United States, to exit the White House gracefully, quietly, and without really any disturbance. They are to leave Washington. Sometimes they stay, but normally they leave Washington. They go back to their lives as private citizens. And they do not meddle. They do not comment. And they do not ridicule the incoming administration. However, Barack Obama is not a typical former president. He is an arrogant, elitist, communist, Marxist, Muslim scumbag that spent eight years fundamentally transforming America and making sure that he destroyed every aspect of what makes America great from our history to our culture to our traditions and he will go down in history as one of if not the worst president in American history. He is the first president to be an illegal alien president. He is the first Muslim president, not African American president. He is the first admitted socialist Marxist communist to win the presidency and possibly the first closeted homosexual. That's to be debated. In all, he is nothing more than a stain an absolute disgusting stain on our history, an unbelievable blemish of miscalculation and bad judgment by the American people, and a sordid black eye suffered in the midst of a geopolitical reputation. In all, a failed, fraudulent presidency.